Hey y'all, welcome back to the Closet Recording Studio for another poem of the day. Today's poem of the day is Snow by Anna Akhmatova. Um, stick around afterwards for a little bonus analysis if you need a jumping off place for the beginning of an essay or something like that. Upon the hard crest of a snow drift we tread and grown quiet we walk on towards my house white enchanted our mood is too tender for talk and sweeter than music this dream now come true the low boughs of the firs that sway as we brush them in passing the slight silver clink of your spurs all right after that short poem it's time for a little bit of bonus analysis first of all i'd like to note that this poem what you're looking at on the screen anyway is a translation of the original and since I can't read Russian I'm not going to read the Russian version of it um, but also because this translation has um, fun things happening with sound and rhythm but we cannot really analyze those in the way we would normally do that because this is a translation and the sounds and the rhythms obviously would be different in Russian than they would be in English. So um, I'm leaving that out on purpose. Um, this is um, a quite tender love poem, in fact, um, and one of the most sincere ones that that we can find in, in the English, well, it's not in English language, in, printed in the English right now anyway. Um, the contrasts, though, are are beautiful because traditionally in poetry winter is meant to be um, a time of death and rest and quiet and um, in endings right um, that's how the season works and usually when the spring the springs are about new lives new life and new relationships and new and so forth and so on um, and we do have the quiet and white stuff here, right? We have snow drifts, we have f things that are frozen solid, we have that kind of stuff going on. But we also have our mood is too tender for talk, um, and we have sweeter than music, and we have this dream come true, um, and those kind of things going on. And like the... Um, we, you, you have the snow, right? So everything's like buried in snow except for the for a couple things. We have the low boughs of the firs and the clink of your spurs, right? So these are things, I mean, the spurs are not really alive, but the sounds come through the snow, the quietness, right? And the low boughs of the firs are trees that even, that even though it's sub-zero temperatures, we assume in Russia, um, in the winter, these are things that still survive and are still green um, during that season. So we have a few things that are representative of the fact that there are things that can still survive through a harsh Russian winter, like um, the sound, um, like these fir trees, and like the love that these two people feel for each other. So. That's kind of where this poem is all set up. Um, we are right now during a pandemic, so wear masks and wash your hands a lot, and I will see you next time. I hope this helped. This video is a production of Thomas and Morris Instruction. The makers of this video would like you to like it, to share it, and to subscribe to our channel to help us with the YouTube algorithm. Thank you.